Now I see by the Spirit of God that God has dealt with you too and disciplined you too and messed with everything about you. There ain't an area in your life God hadn't messed with and straightened this thing out and bent that thing back and picked that thing up and took that thing and threw it down and it's called discipline and it's called correction and it's called instructions in righteousness and God has rebuked you and God has equipped you to get you ready for this day, to launch you into this day, into this season. And the Lord's saying to me right now, He said, you are now entering the best season of your entire ministerial life. This is the word of the Lord for, for you, uh, for both of you. You are now entering into the best, the thing I preserved you for, the thing I built you for. Uh, all of that was good. You helped people all along the way. You got help, the Lord says, all along the way. But I tell you, my son and my daughter, this is, this is your day now. I'm standing you up. The connection has been made. The approval has been given. The disbursement of funds has been released. The anointing is setting upon you. The gift is already established in you. I've already given you an army that will double in size. Did you hear that? Double in size. The Lord said, I want it doubled in size. Twice this many soldiers of the cross. And the Lord said, I'm going to launch you now. And this, uh, th th not just in this one thing, but in other things. And furthermore, I'm going to be launching people out of this church to go and to be a blessing and to, and to help others. They're, a couple are just going to go because you're going to send them away. And, uh, but many are going to come and go out of this house and, and do a great work for me and bring a great report back to you. So you get ready now. You get ready, the Lord says, because I've now brought you to this place. And the Lord says, I want to say this to you, my son, in front of everybody, that uh, I am pleased with you. You have allowed me to form you and shape you. Many times it was uncomfortable. Many times you desired it with all of your heart back in that day and this day and that thing and this thing. You, you wanted it with all of your heart, but it was so tough on your flesh and the reworking of your mind. But now I've made you a commander in my army, a captain of the host. And you're going to help a lot more people than you've ever helped before. In the name of Jesus, I speak that over you by the command of the Lord Jesus Christ. Let's praise him for a minute. Come on. Come on. Let's praise the Lord for a minute. Praise God. 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 And, um, and this new center, uh, that's my will. I birth that in your heart. I'm going to not only bring the helpers and those to do that, everywhere from construction to prayer people to working in there, I'm bringing just the right uh, people to come and be totally remade, the, uh, totally renovated, totally restored to what I want them to be. And the money is also on its way. Don't fret over the money, just pray over it. Everybody say that. Don't fret over the money, say that. Don't fret over the money. Just pray over it, and it's going to come. And I speak that over you in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Let's lift our hands. Come on. All over the house. Praise God.